Thank you for saving me from this eternal shame. I don't know what I would have done without you. Thank you for coming with me. I really appreciate it. <laughs> You're welcome. And you see, they, they liked you. Everybody was just talking about you, taking a liking to you, wanting to come close. <laughs> really? Yes. They all said so. Yes, they whispered to me that you're a nice person that would make a good couple. Ah, <laughs> That's nice. Uh, I'm glad they all liked me and um, finally the mission is accomplished. Yes. Thank you once again. Mm -hmm. Right. I'll see you some other time, okay? Alright. You have a nice day. Bye bye. I'll see you on Monday, yeah? Okay. Has my mouth boss left? Ah. Yes, so <laughs> hopefully in the next one hour uh, she should be home. Oh. Hmm. Do you know what? Yes. I'm already missing her. <laughs> her advice before she left really got to me. <sighs> Until now, I've been wondering why you've not shown interest in me. Obviously, there's a dark side in you. Uh, um. Yes, um, but it's a side I prefer to be left alone. Amarachi, come on. We learn from each other's experience. Is it that bad? Yeah. Very bad. But I survived it. Amala! No? This is the most fine. What happened? You said you've not said anything today. What happened to you? Um, yes, your sister came to the store. Remember I called you to tell you and you told me to give her whatever she wants. Thank you. Alright, thank you. Amara! Oh. I sent a woman here for you to pick up one of her clothes. And she said you didn't pick. What happened? Uh, I'm sorry, Sao, but I have enough clothes. Oh, I noticed it. But I insist to collect. Oh, I'm sorry, sir. But I don't need them. What? Please, sir. Don't be offended, but I don't need them. I have enough. Amara, see, I know you have enough. But when it comes to money and clothes, no woman has enough. I know you're just turning my advances down, and it's not fair. I'm sorry, sir. I'm so sorry about that. But remember, I've told you several that I have a boyfriend. And I, I don't want to offend him. I love my boyfriend. Which boyfriend? See, Amara, you used to be here and see the kind of girls that come to this place to look for me. And I turned them down just because of you. And you know I like you. And this time you'll be telling me about your boyfriend. Ah. Please, sir. I can't cheat on my boyfriend. Good boyfriend? If I consider a work here, go and meet your boyfriend. I'm sucking you from now and so just go out of my shop. What do you ah. mean by your boyfriend? See, you are, you are not complying with me. You make this place, I leave this place for you, to, for you to handle. You know I have other places. And if you comply very well, you know I'm going to accept you up to one. And you tell me about my boyfriend. If I go, I'm no longer interested. Go. Sir, just go, go, sir, go, go, go. This, this, I, I don't want to lose I'm, I'm not longer interested. Go, go and meet your boyfriend. I don't want to lose my job, please. I'm not interested. Go, go, please. Go, 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 go. Sir, go, please, go, go, please, go, go, please, go, go, please, go, 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 because of my brother. Truth be told, I really do admire and appreciate you. And I wish he would appreciate you more. I know why I'm saying this in his presence. 
auxilios. That means it's you. Only God will punish that means that you. you, you just because no, you, 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 you ought to really if you if only you stand early. Eh? Mr. Izu, God will punish him. That man, eh? That man. One day he go rape person. They, they go they go jail that man. Wickedness is that? Eh? Just go go here if you go 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 My love, my heart is so bleeding right now because you 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 have to lose your job because of the love you have for me. You have really proven that. Your love and loyalty is paramount to you than gifts, money, and even your job. I appreciate this. In as much as I am not happy that you you lost your job already, I will make it up to you. I promise you. Someday, I will make it up to you. I will not forget this kind gesture in a hurry. I wanted to promise myself. Promise? Hey, anything, anything you want me to do? Just say it. Okay? Promise me you will never leave me. I don't want anything else. I just want your love and nothing more. My love. If I have ever doubted your love, now it's clear to me. I love you so much and you know it. I love you so, so dearly. I promise you, I will never leave you or do anything that will bring you tears. Okay? Come here, come here. Come here. Listen. I don't care about anything in the world. All I want is your love and nothing more. Please, don't leave me. You have my love. You have it right here. Can you feel it? Love is a fairy tale. Love is a fairy tale. To sun, to sun, to Love is so real. Love is so real. I feel mainly on me. Let go. Hello. You're in here, wait. Yes, sir. Is it morning already? Ah. You're dressed already. Uh, where are you rushing to? Remember I told you I have to go to the house to prepare for my travel for Oka tomorrow. Uh, yeah. Besides, okay. I've washed all your clothes. I cooked soup and stew for you. Mm, so and I bought nice. one painter of rice, beans and gari. Wow. Have it. Come on, think. This is 5,000 Naira. In case you want to go out and look for jobs. I withdrew all my money in my account just for you. Mara, what would I have done in my life without you? You have made my life so colorful. Sometimes I, I feel that so much money you're giving me is even making me lazy to, to make money. It's... <laughs> Thank you so much. You know, girls of nowadays, they hardly put up with, they hardly reason with a man that, that is not resourceful, like making money. 
but you still there is with me. Am I right here, my love? Reason with me. <laughs> if I no get today, I go get them tomorrow. Amen. <laughs> Thank you so much, my love. Thank you so much. I appreciate. I appreciate. Do and come back, oh, because I'm missing you already. Oh, I'm missing you too. You know what? I'll call you when I get there. Okay. Okay, my love. Come here. Come here. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you uh, so much. Be safe and, and please don't enter any bus that you don't see the color uniform or so you know gonna enter one chance. Okay? <laughs> okay. okay. Alright, take care. Take care, man. Bye. Right. Safe journey. Eh? Uh, bye bye. <laughs> Do you know Marachi washed all your dirty clothes and cooked for us? She says. I don't know what she sees in you. She has been feeding us with her money just because you don't have a job. She washes for you, she cleans your house, she even cooks for us. <laughs> I don't even know what she sees in you. Well, not even as if you're fine. I'm not even good looking for any woman to even accept to get you to all to have something to do with you. <laughs> if not that you're my sister, eh? I will say let thunder from uh, 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 Umaya fire you. Eh? Thank God she's not your type. Thank God she's not your type that will not love a man without without getting money in return. Eh? You wonder what she sees in me. How will you see anything in, in, in me? Eh? Then will you get out before before I, I get angry and, and get out and leave? I know why you're asking me to leave. Is it not because I also when I came here, I saw you laughing and smiling and you were hiding something behind you. I know it's money. I, I know it's money. That's why you want me. I will leave. No problem. I, mm, that, Somebody should somebody should tell me where they sell people. I need to sell this my sister. Ababo. Get out! That was how I lost my job in the shop. And all the gifts Izu showered on me. Just because I was in love with Osita. And I sacrificed a lot for him. I mean I I practically fed and clothed him with my little salary until my bank account got depleted. <sighs> all, all through my trip to Oka, I was concerned about him. Sad. Very sad. So, what happened when you traveled? My, my trip was aborted and I couldn't travel I couldn't travel again. So I went to my father's house instead of going to Osita's house. The next day I decided to to pay him a visit without informing him because I had a spare key. And then I, I, I wanted to surprise him. Ah, my sister, I couldn't do. So I said, let me come and see you, sister. Is he inside? No, he's not around. Oh. He went out this morning, very, very early in the morning. <sighs> okay, you know what? Let me just pick something for me now. Hmm? Um, um, excuse me. Um, come, stop, Joe. Don't worry, I'll see you. Yeah. Um, Tell me you are back already. When? Honey, honey, who is this? Who is she? 
Come on, speak up. Who is she? Uh, uh, oh, she. Yeah. Amara. Uh, she, she's my fiance. And she's Amara, my friend. Oh, Amara, how are you? She's your fiance. And I'm your friend. Honey, is everything all right? Why did she just behave so weird? It's okay, everything is fine. It's one of those girls that throws themselves at me. Every okay, man, man, okay. Bana chaka bana la chai bo dogu. Huh? Bana do chali bo dogu. Try to take your life. Yes. For a man I gave my first love and sacrificed so much for. It was very devastating for me. I found myself in the hospital with my mother by my bedside. From what my parents told me, they said I. They said it took hours for the doctors to flush out the pills from my system. The doctor said I was, I was lucky enough because they, they had brought me in on time. If not for my loving and caring mother, who washed over me day and night, I would have killed myself because she spoke sense into me. My, my word had shattered. My daughter, I'm glad you're back home. There's something you must understand about this life. Those whose foundation are right, the sky is their limit. The, fun, the right foundation we gave you, we attract good things to you. Men will come queuing up, begging for your hand in marriage. Good men see virtue in women. Be patient. Thank you. Mark my word. As for Osita, he will come begging you. He will go around and discover that he once met a jewel and lost her. Those that value the jewel will scramble for it. Keep your upbringing and do not allow materialism 
to detect your choice of a husband. It is the wrong way. Because good men work hard and take time to blossom. Do not allow materialism to detect your choice of a husband. I'm praying for you. It is well. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. You're welcome. I'm doing my job. It's your mother. I can understand what you went through. I'm very sorry. But you have to live with your mother's advice. You are a jewel. And I am happy to be your friend. Because you have influenced me so positively. Thank you. I vowed not to have anything with men ever again in my life. Until Mama spoke to us before she left. Well, uh, <laughs> it's, it's all in the past now. We have to leave for today and tomorrow. I totally agree with what Mama said. That we meet one bad and irresponsible man today does not mean that we won't meet one good one out there. Okay. There are still good men out there. Just chill. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay, come on. That's actually my kid. Thank you. How are you? Fine, thank you. Please, um, Amara, around. I need to see her. It's very urgent and it's very important. I hope there's no problem. I, I wouldn't know until I've seen and spoken with her. Okay. Um, please, um, make sure you're around when she comes. I, I want you to be around when I'm, I'm talking to her. Why? Just, just call her first, please. Hamara, um, I know I have pestered you a lot, but please just bear with me. Please so oblige me this one request. Tatus, what is the problem? You're not saying anything. Talk to me. You see, my, my boss's wife called me through her husband's phone. And she requested to speak with you. I told her you were not around, so she asked me to tell you to get back to her as soon as you're back. I am not interested in such game. I don't have time for all this. Please, the last time was, it, it was fun the last time, and that's it. Please, what, what, what do you expect them to feel when they find out that we're only fooling them? And this will be the last time. After now, you will not do it again, but just save my neck this one's time. I'm begging you, please, honestly. I, 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 it's, it's like she has taken some liking to you, and it will be unfortunate and unfair. For you not to get back to her, just just get back to her and know what it is she wants to hear. 
hear from you. After this, I will not disturb you again. Bikunu, please. No, please, I can't. Amara, don't do this to me. Consider my job. My job is on the line, please. I can't, please. What will people say? So, very soon when I start working on the road, people will start calling me Mrs. Donatus, Mrs. Donatus. For what? Please. I How would I start explaining to them that it, it was just a joke? I promise you, after this once, I will never disturb you again. Uh, please, I don't want people to know that I'm. Uh, please, 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 please. Shoma, let me talk to her now, please. It's, it's just this one. Just come down. He told you to come and convince me, right? He did. But I told him I wouldn't. Hmm. I know you too well. Sooner or later, you will bring it up. Well, let me make it easier for you. I have decided to go with him. For the sake of his job. But please, I am begging you, please, advise him to go get himself a wife or at least a girlfriend. Thank you. You're welcome. I know you have a good heart. And you wouldn't love to see anyone in trouble. But why didn't you tell him that? Uh, that's because I don't want him to get used to it or make it a tradition for himself. See, I am not a wife for Aya. No. All the same, I would like to go there to see how the rich people live because I know someday I'll be a rich girl. What about me? Uh, it's about the most oh, you know. <laughs> Yeah, right. Yeah. I'm so excited. Oh, it's Where's the rack? Thank you. Okay. Hmm. Um, good afternoon, ma. Don't notice. That was so fast. Up to 10 minutes, your wife called you and you are here. Right? <laughs> were you expecting her calls? Not really. Actually, I was around the neighborhood when she called to tell me you were done with the meeting. I was only kidding. Mm? She's not only beautiful but intelligent. Thank yeah? you. She should be in the city making money. Mm? <laughs> you know you are beautiful. <laughs> Thanks for the compliments, Ma. Thank you. Mm. Lest I forget, Donatus. Madam. Are you aware that our hotel in Oka needs a new management? And um my husband has shortlisted three people to go down to Oka to manage it. But due to the relationship I have with your wife, I told him to consider you for the post. You know, it comes with promotion and more. What do you think about it? Oh my gosh. Madam, I'm short of words. I didn't expect this. Thank you so much. <laughs> Don't thank me. Thank your wife. <laughs> thank, yeah? you. thank you. Ma. <laughs> thank you, ma. Thank you, ma. You have the best. When it comes to play of love, thank you, God bless you. Somebody's heart has a risky. Money for the big and the lap. That did not danger us. If you look big and the lap. That did not danger us. Big and the lap. That did not danger us. Little pussy, little girl. That did not danger us. My God. My God. Did you hear what she said? That she was going to talk to her husband to provide me a slate. <laughs> you are not just a piece of beauty. You are a bundle of good luck. <laughs> what did you even do to her to, to, to excite her that much? Um, 
nothing much. Actually, our <laughs> sister's private school is not doing well in Lagos. So I gave her a few suggestions, which she actually likes. And that's all. Just that? Just that. Oh my God. You don't know what you have done to me. Look, within this period of time, you have changed my life for good. <laughs> and I have you to thank for it. Oh, come on, Dana. Anyone could do that. Thank There's you nothing so special. much. You know what? I'm going to give you a treat. I'm taking you to a supermarket so you can pick anything you like. A supermarket? Yes. Uh, okay, that's nice. Get it. <laughs> <laughs> If you want to talk, talk. The lady by dangerous. If you want to yeah, know, yeah. The lady by dangerous. If you want to move, move. The lady by dangerous. Is this love that I'm seeing? Is this love that I'm seeing? Are you so dangerous? We can do the love. Are you so dangerous? <laughs> look, at, look at you! I'm a... Oh my god! 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 You know? And you still look handsome. Well. <laughs> so tell me, what are you doing? Uh, of course, Anioma is my village, like you've forgotten. <laughs> yeah, this is my village. And uh, basically, this is one of the biggest in town. So, whenever I'm around, I dash in here to shop. So, the question is, Amara, what are you doing in my village? Well, <laughs> I work here. Okay. I'm a teacher in Anioma Girls Secondary. Aha. Uh -huh. uh -huh. so Aha. Okay. Okay. <laughs> hey. Oh my god. Can you imagine? I'm not, no, no, like seriously. Like, no. I'm not, no, like seriously. What have you been doing? I'm going to tell me you have not been sucking blood. No. <laughs> because this beauty is not ordinary. No, please. Okay. Um, what about. I mean, Anioma has a lot of beautiful places, you know, local, local. No much tall buildings, anyway, you know, but about them. Um, some places we can just sit, maybe catch up, you know. What do you think? It's been a while, I mean. Of course. Today, tomorrow? Tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow is fine. Aha! It's so nice to catch up with you, man. So tell me, what about our friends and all that and all that? I've not seen them since, too. I don't even know where they all went to. <laughs> this is the way we used to do it in I school. I know, right? Yes. Uh -huh. so, who is right? Are you? <laughs> Good to see you, my friend. So, um, contact. Oh, your sure. Number. So I can. All right. Okay. Oh, my God. <laughs> hey. Good to see you. Good to see you, too. Okay, so, tata. Tomorrow. Sure. I'm uh, no disappointing. I promise. <laughs> Bye. My dear, sorry for the delay. The cashier had a lot to attend to. We can go now, right? All right. This is so beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> My village has a um, most beautiful serin around the neighboring villages. Uh, good landscapes everywhere. You know, when I was a baby, I used to run everywhere, like naked. <laughs> 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 I prefer it to the city. Yeah. Trust me, I do. <laughs> good to catch up with you. Yeah, but. I must be sincere. After our NYC, you disappeared. 
no one got um, an information about your address and why did you do that, Amara? <laughs> uh, to tell you the truth, hmm? I didn't know you'd be interested. Like I didn't know at all. Hmm. And I heard you got married. <laughs> <laughs> okay, talking about getting married. Yes, my family wanted me to get married. After all, I was done with my first degree. All right. And also, they wanted me to take over from my father. Again, become more responsible. So, I was searching for you everywhere to at least propose. Hmm. Why you were nowhere to be found. Really? Come on, Amara. We were in love. Of course, we loved each other and we had dreams. We? You know, I was... I was scared that you, you were too serious. I... I didn't want to rush into marriage. Mm -mm. So tell me, your parents wanted you to get married immediately. Did you? I did. Yeah. I was married for three years. Oh. And I and my family lived in Lagos. Right? Well. I lost my wife after three years. Oh. Yeah. She gave birth to her son five years now. And, uh, mm. I'm so sorry about that. It's fine. It wasn't easy, you know, but I moved on. Just like a month ago, we came down here. I actually came down with my son, the nanny. I want to establish a sachet water company around and <laughs> you know, he's my joy. <laughs> yeah. Please, can I come and see him? Can I meet him? Look oh, on, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Look at you. So when it comes to play of love, let's lose and win some conversation. See. Okay. Yes. We here. Wow. You got a nice place. You've done well for yourself. Well. Almighty mm. Father, I thank you for the compliments. So, where's the boy? Where's the son, Junior? Oh, what's... Hey, Junior, come over here. Oh, come on over here. <laughs> How are you, Daddy? Yeah. Mm. So, welcome to Daddy. Welcome, Daddy. Yeah. How are you doing? I'm fine. Okay, now, go say good evening to Auntie. Hmm? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Good evening. Good evening. How are you? I'm fine. Oh, he's so cute. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Will you be my mommy? <laughs> oh. That's Oh my God. Yes, I will be your mommy if you want me to become your mommy. Okay. Thank you. Aww. He said thank you. I like him already. <laughs> go back and finish your food. Fast, go back and finish your food. Hey, Daddy. I'll talk to you there, okay? Bye. Okay, um, this is my friend. We were... Good friends back in our school days. Yeah. Uh, lost but found, I will say. Well, this is my friends. Nice to meet you, Lonnie. Okay. What kept you so long? No, I thought I told you I was to travel back to the city. 
sorry, I was caught up in one or two. Mm -hmm. uh, <coughs> so. Uh, okay, now I think I should take my leave now. Mm. I've already seen Julius. Okay. So you just came. Come on. Uh, Seeds, at least let me get you water or anything. No, it's, it's fine. It's just that thing, okay? Maybe some other time. All right, bye, Loma. Oh, oh, okay, sure. Uh, hey, I did not expect that I'm uncivil behavior from you, Roma. <laughs> and what is uncivil and rude about my behavior? Very rude. Very uncivil. In fact, rude is when someone is introduced to you and you ignore the person's greetings. Yes. I did not expect that from someone of a social class like you. Social class, my foot. Social class, my foot. I will tell you what is uncivil and rude. It is when you leave me here and go frolicking with some village girl. Let me also drum it in your ear that it is improper to insult someone you do not know anything about. Get that. I don't care. I don't care who your father is. You don't keep paramount in the house and go after bronze. I don't care. I don't care at all. Take me home this minute. Thank you, you just made our day this evening. Thank you. You're welcome, it's my pleasure. <laughs> Sorry, you know this. I've been meaning to ask you something. Go ahead. Why don't you have a girlfriend? Okay, I knew you would bring that question up. I knew it's a question to have. You've been waiting to ask me for a long time. Okay. I'll make it as short as possible. Please be sad. I was dating this girl many years ago, here in this village. We were very, very close. And, uh, along the line, she got pregnant. And then we planned to get married. A week before our wedding, I discovered the pregnancy was on time. It belonged to another guy from the neighboring community. I was not only devastated, I was disappointed and caught. It was a very difficult thing for me to do at that time, so I made up my mind not to date any girl or to become somebody. I decided to work hard and get something out of the way. That's it. Yeah. I'm sorry about that. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry <coughs> to take you back to that. Sadly, you're in the past now. All the partners now is on hard working, I'm happy where I am. And I hope you can get that to I want you to promise me something about it. Yeah. What's the thing? Promise that you'll come visit me in my camp in two weeks time. Of course I will. Why not? I've been wanting to travel to Oka since. And then, um, thanks for the invitation. You're welcome. My pleasure. Thank you. <laughs> we will miss you so very much. You're right. Um, since my Oga has given me a car, I'll take that. Thank you. Hey, wait, 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 wait. So, if you're giving us this keke finish, eh? And we are driving it. <laughs> People have seen us using it. You now come back. It's not that you now come back later and come back and let it go. No, 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 no. It's yours. <laughs> yours and yours. Like it's ours. Like <laughs> <Yes>. Permanently. <laughs> <laughs> so we now have a ride. Yes. Uh, okay, okay. Uh, 
Congratulations. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. Come back once again. Um, another thing I want to take you from this. Anything. That you go and drop me at the park tomorrow. Oh, that's no problem. I will do that. <laughs> <laughs> I'll come to first thing early in the morning. I'll come. Alright, thank you. Thank I'll you. be on my way now. Okay? Yes, yes, yes. Uh, Yes, I know the place. I've asked about it before. What I would do is just, uh, just go and take it out and see how it works. It won't take long. Just take Okay, let me call you back later. Thank you. Good morning. Good morning, Amara. How are you? I'm fine. I hope I'm not late. No, no. You're on time. <sighs> I mean, we even have time enough for me to tell you what I've always wanted to tell you. But I promise to be brief about it. I hope there's no problem. Not at all, no problem, Amara. You know, ever since I've been coming to drop you to and from school, I've taken my time to observe you. And by the day, I am convinced that you're the woman I want to spend the rest of my life with. Moreover, you have brought me more luck and joy. Don't, 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 don't rush it, honestly. I'm not trying to put you under any kind of pressure. Just take your time and think about it, okay? Ah, if you want shoot, uh, shoot, uh, let you are dangerous. If you want, see, what is he doing there? Who is he? That's a kene. Really? Hi, Kenny. Hi, Amara. Tell me you're coming in today. Oh, well, uh, I called your number, but it wasn't going through, so I decided to come. Oh, that's true. I normally switch off my phone in school, but I forgot to turn it on. Well, it's fine. Ah. <laughs> meet my friend. Oh, okay. <laughs> Hi, Choma. Choma meets my lost but found friend, Ekene. Hi, Choma. Pleasure. Same I am Kenny. I'm Choma. Pleasure, hi. I'm out. I'm inside. Okay, there. Hi, um, Amara. I actually came to apologize for what happened the other day in my house i felt i owe you an explanation oh come on you don't owe me any explanation you told me about i remember you see most ladies will feel that way on seeing another lady in their fiance's house so <laughs> well I and the Loma's relationship is a product of uh, parental matchmaking, you know, so, I mean, but it's not working, it's not working actually. Then I'll suggest you guys should sit down, discuss your differences and see if it will work out. Well, uh, if that would change, because basically I think it's too late. If it would have happened, it would have been from the parents. Ulama was born and bred in the city. She doesn't even know anything. She doesn't speak Igbo. She doesn't understand anything. You know, I can't even You know, so, I mean, we are different people. It's not working. That's very sad. How is your son? <laughs> exactly why I came. He woke up this morning and uh, all he said was, where is Auntie Amara? So I tried to make him, you know, eat, do other things, but he refused. Only when I promised him that you're going to come. And he decided to have his breakfast. So that is why I'm here. For the sake of that boy, he loves you. And I, I love him too. Um, 
I will come, but I hope it's not going to bring any conflicts between you and Uloma because I, I don't want any problem. If not, I won't come. Hey, listen, I get it in check. Trust me, don't worry, it's not a problem. All right? Uh, if you want shoot, uh, shoot, uh, be like you are dangerous. If you want to talk, uh, talk, uh, be like you are dangerous. If you want to talk, uh, talk, be like you are dangerous. If you want to talk, talk, uh, be like you are dangerous. What's this love? You just got a call from the building site. Hey. I hope all is well. Yeah, well, all is well, my dear. No, it's um, basically, I think they are short of uh, materials. It happens once in a while, you know, and uh, I have to rush in to solve it because the building has an estimated time. You know, so, so we can start up what we are here for. Right, so it's not a problem. Oh, uh, okay, so um, let me check if you I don't have any chairs, I just have to stay and watch you. Thank you very much. All right, so uh, 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 yeah. there you go. She works here. Uh, 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 if you want, shoot, uh, shoot. Uh, if you want to talk, uh, talk, uh, you let it be dangerous. Love the sweet, yeah. This life is too the sweet, yeah. Money for the pick and the lap, uh, that thing is dangerous. Yeah. If you want to pick and the lap, uh, Love this with you. 
This life is too dangerous with you. Money for the big and the poor. And I tell them, what is two times two? Good boy. Two times two. Wow. Two times three. Ooh. Two times four. Wow. Two times five. Ah. Two times six. Yay! That's my guy. Ooh. Good boy. Yay. Two times eight. So long. Yeah, uh, I'm sorry. <clears throat> I don't know what's to do. Ah, it's 8 p.m. Do you want something to eat? I prepare soup and jollof rice. It's fine. I had a late lunch day. Meanwhile, I washed all the clothes in the bathroom, made jollof rice <clears throat> and soup. How are you able to do all that? Come on, it's nothing. She doesn't know how happy I am finding you again. Thank you very much for coming around. <laughs> I think I should be on my way now. 
Please kiss Junior for me when he wakes up. Sure. Right. Thank you. Okay. Um, thank you. You are one of the million. What do you mean by that? Which woman did you bring into this house? Again, which woman did you bring into this house? Because Junior, out of excitement, told me everything. So don't even deny it. Deny what? Huh? Hold on. Are you saying I should start giving you an account of who comes in here and goes? Is that what you want? Not exactly. For this particular one, who is she? And then I start talking, who is she? Okay, who came here is Amara. And why she came is because she is an old friend. Okay, are you having an affair with that village girl? No, 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 tell me, are you having an affair with her? I am not having an affair with her. Hmm? Well, if the interrogation section is over, can I walk now? Excuse you. Quite excuse me. Again, <laughs> stop inviting that girl to this house. Stop inviting her to this house. I have said my own. Because the next time I will see her again in this house, you won't like what I will do to her. Stop inviting her into this house. Did I wake you up? It's um, it's past ten at night. I just want to call you and find out what time exactly you'll be coming over the weekend. That will be tomorrow. That's why I Okay then, that's fine. All right, I'll be expecting you. Good night. Too. Hello, I'm on. Yeah, yes, how are you? Not about to. No, um, okay, Junior insisted I call you that he wants to talk to you. Oh, I've been stealing the phone to you. Okay, Daddy, talk to Mommy. Hello, Mommy, good evening. Oh, hello, Junior, how are you? I'm not fine. My nanny beats me. Uh -uh. Why would she do that? What did you do to her? You know what? Don't worry. When I meet her, I'm deal with her. Right? Yes. Uh, you know what? Make sure you always eat your food, always finish your own work, and have your bath before going to bed. Okay? Will you come tomorrow? Yes. Yes, you will. Yes, you will. I'll see you tomorrow after school, okay? Thank you, mommy. I'll see you tomorrow. See you. Bye bye. That's my boy. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, thank you. Okay. Yes, I am, but I'll have to come by to see Jimmy before traveling tomorrow. Have a good night, sleep. Mm -hmm. What's so dangerous? And who are you? 
don't you recognize me? <laughs> Pardon my poor memory. You know, so many village people do come here to beg for arms, so one thing or the other. You know, so please, what can I do for you? Uh, my name is Amara. I'm a Kenez um, old schoolmate. Oh, oh, oh. You are the village girl I can brought to the house the other day. I see. So, what do you want? I'm here to see you again with this son. Oh. Okay, they, they're not around. They went to see their parents. Uh, well, can I ask him to come? And I spoke to him just a few minutes ago. Hello? I just told you Ekene is not in. Um, um, come, 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 come. Um, I remember the other day, Ekene introduced me to you yes. as his fiance, right? Yes. Good. Now listen, whatever you want to come to this house, make sure you have my permission. You don't just come here like that. Okay? I'm so particular about who comes in here and who goes in out of this house. So you make sure that you seek my consent first. Just hear from him that he has gotten to me like I'm aware and I have given my approval. Else, the next time you walk into this house, I will push you out. Am I understood? Yes. And I'm so sorry for that. So dangerous. I thought I heard someone at the door. I didn't notice anyone. Oh, oh okay. Right. Daddy, my mom is not here yet. Oh, okay. My boy, we are still expecting your mommy. She will soon be here, okay? All right. So dangerous. If you want to shoot, shoot, delay the bad dangerous. If you want to talk, talk, delay the bad dangerous. If you want to yeah, yeah, delay the bad dangerous. If you want to move, move, delay the bad dangerous. Is this love that I'm seeing? Is this love that I'm seeing? Are you a sword and So risky, we can do the poor, but it was so dangerous. You're welcome to my humble abode. Welcome to Oka. Wow, <laughs> you've really done well for yourself. We give God the glory. Oh, it's so nice. Thank you. Come, let's go upstairs so I'll show you. Uh, no problem. Uh, sorry. Uh, hello? Hello, Ekene. Good evening. Ekene, why did you do this to me? You told me to come to your house that you'd be waiting for me. I got there and you were not around. Really? No, no, no. I'm really not. I haven't stepped out of this house. No, I came to your house and your fiancé told me that you, you went out. Hello? Oh no. Hello? 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 Hello?
No, she just got to say that she has gotten to her car. Oh, really? Do you know she actually told me yesterday, but I totally forgot. <laughs> you were good being easy, Kali, man. <laughs> mm. We branched by your house before I took her to the park. And she was told by a lady that you and your son were not around. In fact, she made it clear to Amara that she is not welcome to your house. Tomorrow I'll take you somewhere else. I need to show you around the city. I need to make you see the nice places we have here. Yeah, I can't wait to see it. Yes. Okay. Time to go to bed. No, wait. I need to finish this match. Please. No. Mm -mm. Oh, oh, please, that's... it's a very interesting match. I need to catch up on no. this. No. Wait. Do you want me to beat you? Please. No, let's go. Come here. <laughs> oh.
just want to say thank you for coming around to stay with me. You don't know what joy you have brought into my life with your presence. <laughs> okay. Wow. Oh my goodness, this is this is so beautiful. I'm glad you like it. Thank you. I really do appreciate this. Thank you. It is nothing, it's just a token to say I appreciate you being there for me. And I also want to use this opportunity to ask you a question that's been on my mind for a long time. Will you marry me, Amara? <sighs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. You have made me the happiest man on earth today, you know. Thank you. Um, Donatus, are you sure this is what you really want? Like, have you really observed me enough to know if I am the woman you want to spend the rest of your life with? Yes. It's part of the reason I always come to take you to and from school. I have taken my time to observe and study you and I have, I'm more than convinced that you are the woman I want to spend the rest of my life with, okay? Are you resisting me? No, I'm not resisting you. I mean, we've already decided that we'll go see my parents. You just have to be patient. Okay, I just wish you were not going back to the village. I wish you would stay here forever and never leave me. Well, like you said, I'll have patience until we have seen your parents. Mm -hmm. Thank you for accepting to be my wife. I love you. Don't you know that it is improper for strangers to walk into people's houses without their consent? Now, stand up and get out. Stand up and get out. You know, I know your type and the little village game you're playing. The last time I checked, Ekene is not mine. And is an adult to associate with anyone he wants to. So please, stop acting like the queen of the village. Because I am not leaving. Listen, you rural brat. If you don't stand up here and get out, I will. She's not going anywhere. Okay. Yeah. Listen, how many times have I warned you not to ask my guest out? And you do not have any right to do that whatsoever. Are you choosing this local chicken over me? Whatever. The choice is yours. But she's not living. So what that means, whatever that means. Hey, I'm sorry, okay. I understand she didn't let you in your time. But this time, my apologies. You will come begging! And when you do, I'll have answers for you. This is not right. Ekene, she's your fiance. You have to call her back. Hey, listen. This is my house, so do not say such thing. Oh. Ekene, please. I think I better leave. 
I don't want to come between you two. No. Listen, I let you go before. Now I have found you again. I will not let you go. No, and I mean it. I can it. What are you saying? What about her? Okay. This girl you see is actually a product of my parents wanting me to marry someone I do not have any feelings for. Yes. Could you see, we are not even the same kind of person. We are two different people in one place. At least you saw everything. Hey, I'm not even married to her. And it's like this. Okay. This does not get along with my boy. So what will be the fate of that little boy when she comes into this house? <laughs> I do not want to play with my boy. Me, I can handle him. But my boy, no. was a man, one man I could relate with, then later settle down with in marriage. But now, there are two of them proposing to me in the space of three days. <sighs> Amara, you need to calm down. You need to calm down so we resolve this issue. Between Donatus and Ekene, which one do you prefer? <sighs> Donatus. Donatus came and was studying me. I got used to him and liked him. Look at the, the keke and the necklace he bought just to prove his love for me. And again. I was in love with Ekene back then in school. But the affair didn't flourish and I ran away from it. And then now we we are back together. And I discovered he he truly loved me. Right in front of me. He told his fiance that he chose me over her. Not many men would do that. And then the little boy, he loves me so much. The very first time we set our eyes on each other, we just, we just fell in love. I truly love that little boy. But how will I turn my back on him? <sighs> oh my lord. I, I, I was supposed to be happy, but now I'm confused. <sighs> this one entire your body will win. Strong woman. I think there's something that enter your body. Let me call her. Let's do it. This one reach your bone. You reach your body well well. This one wants to I'm open this one. Hello mama, good evening. Amara, how are you? Your father is seated here with me as I speak. Ah, good evening, Papa. I hope all is well though. Your father sends his greeting, it's all is well. There's a reason we called you. What reason? It's about this uh, young man, Osita. The one that used to be your friend. Osita Ojimba? What does he want? He has been coming here, my daughter. He has been coming and begging and... 
you're bringing gifts and food stuff and your father said we're not going to collect anything from him until we get your permission why did you people allow him to come in the first place no no my daughter it's not like that initially your father did not open the door for him he now went to talk to your father's friends and they came with him begging and pleading for him what does he want my daughter he wants to reconcile with you he's begging so you should forgive him mama please tell papa i have forgiven him and please tell him to stay away from me. let him not come close to me if not hmm, i will do something that all of you regret though you guys regret my actions so please Obi, I told you, I knew what that man did to my daughter. How she suffered when he left her and went for one rich girl in the city. Amara, you have to calm down. What is it? Is he not all sitter? What does he want? I don't know. It's okay. Just, just take things easy. So, are you saying... Mara says she has forgiven him, but she does not want anything to do with him. Okay, she said so. Mm, I see. I expected it. And the young man rescued the princess. And the king was so happy that he gave out the hand of the princess to the young man for marriage. And guess what happened? They got married and they lived happily ever after. So now tell me, what did you learn from the story? I learned that we should not look down on people because we might not Yay, that's my boy. Clap for yourself. Hey, buddy. Chop knuckle. Yeah, that's my boy. Okay, now it's, my boy. now it's time for you to sleep. Early to rest. Early to sleep. Early to rest. That's my boy. Yay, let's go. Let's go. Hey, buddy. Come. Say good night to daddy. Ekene? Ekene? I'll be right back. Uh, oh, hey. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you! Come on! So you still play this, this prank of yours that you saw annoying me back then in school, eh? You're such a naughty boy. Oh, stop, 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 No kissing. Why? Like? We will get there soon. Why be in a hurry? Okay. Um, I want to go and see your parents. When will I go and see your parents? When you. I'm ready. Hey, come on. I'm ready. Let's let's hit the button. I mean, I'm ready. <laughs> okay. Uh okay, I'll inform them to tell them that I'm that I'm inviting you. Really? Mm -hmm. 
That would be nice. Don't do that. Stop it. Don't do that. Stop it. You know I hate it when you do that. Do not do that. So. And I love you too. <sighs> so, um, until I go see your parents, that's when I can kiss you, right? Yes. So, no kissing, no touching. What if I refuse? <laughs> Oster, how are you? I'm fine. I can see. Uh, well, uh, my wife and I were able to get across to Amara, my daughter, uh, concerning your request. And the truth is that uh, she said she has forgiven you, but she doesn't want to see you again. That is just the story. Papa, I, I know you can do better than this. I know you can convince her. If if only I can just see her just once. Please. Sita, I am not the one directly involved. But then I... I don't know, except you want me to call her again. Uh, so you can hear her talk. Okay, I'm not going to go, Papa. Mm. Okay, I'm not going to go. Hello? Amara? Hello? Yeah, how are you? Hello, Papa. I'm fine. Uh, I hope you're fine. Okay. Yeah, it is uh, about Osita. Oh, gracious. Uh, he's here with me. Why does he bother you too? Why not simply want him to stop this story? Uh, Amara, listen. You see, the way we human beings look at things might be quite different from the way God sees them. I I know really maybe Osita may have offended you or and us, but if we don't forgive him, we are not better. Yes, yes. Of course. I I, I, I just want you to consider it. Yes. He is here. Won't you talk to him? Okay, okay. Let, uh, speak with him. Hello? Amara, how are you? Why have you decided to torment my parents? What do you intend to achieve? Let me tell you. Even if you get them to forgive, I, Amara, will never forgive. If you like, move into your apartment and move them. It will not move me. I am warning you, do not come close to me. I, 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 can you, can I, hello? 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 Oh, so the, uh, can you feel her emotions? I told you she's angry at you. She's bitter. Papa, I know. I know she's hot. Uh, but I'm not going to give up. I wasn't expecting it to be easy. Uh, uh, Papa, can I ask you for a favor, please? Oh, please go ahead, if I can. Can you just um, please give me her address in the city? Papa, good day, sir. I'm still in school. Still about Ah, oh my goodness. Why is this thing disturbing you too? Why can't you want him to stop coming to you? My dear, everything has a purpose. Sometimes, the way we see these things is different from the rest. Most of them may have offended you. You might have offended us. But we have to forgive you. We are not better. Why don't you speak with us? Hello, Sita. Why are you tormenting my parents? Why? What do you want from them? See, let me tell you, even if my parents decide to forgive you, I, Amara, will never ever forgive you. If you like, move into their apartment and stay with them. But let me warn you, do not ever, ever, ever come close to me, okay? Nonsense. 
Mama, this is your story. Na fool Telemundo. Better one. How now? I'm I see you getting married to two men at the same time. I'm going to be the first person with the glove for Nigerian history. <laughs> Baby, <laughs> I salute you. I come on those for you. <laughs> You're laughing. You get laugh, back. Babe, see, eh? anything will want happen. Make it happen. I know if you can't be Lord of the Rings. Okay, maybe. Uh -huh, no. I See, as it stands, so men know what. Okay, maybe. And they tell you. <laughs> men know what. Um. Do it. I do. Men know what I mean. <laughs> So sorry about this. But who are you? What is happening? My name is Osta. I am. Uh... I have heard a lot about you. And do you have to come back here after what you did to the poor girl? Do you know what she went through because of you? You are very lucky she had, she, she poured just water. If not me, if it be acid or hot water. Come on here! Good. Make I see you here again. You. Amara, I lost you once. Not going to lose you again. Not now. Never. Osita, which Osita? How did you get my number? No, 
I am not trying to question your actions. But giving Osita Amara's house address is not a good idea. I think that is not enough. You only gave him a Joma's phone number. Honestly, if I don't know you very well as a man of honor and integrity, I would have said maybe Osita has bribed you. Oh, thank God you have said it. As a man of honor and integrity. Of course, I know it that you are the only person that knows me too well. In fact, more than any other living person on this earth. And I have to tell you this. Like I used to tell you, there are so many things that the physical eyes cannot see as far as human life is concerned. Oh yes. Sometimes we may not accept things the way they appear. Because life itself is a riddle. We should apply patience so as to allow things to unfold naturally. Take their natural course. So when we pray to God, we always ask God for direction. Not so. Uh -huh. And then when we ask for God's direction, why are we in a hurry? Can't we be patient enough to allow God to direct us even in his own mysterious ways? Because if we do it our way, we may be faster than our shadow. Thereby, we may derail going out of God's direction. In carbon equal, but the truth remains the truth, no matter how bitter. I need to speak with you. Just give me a moment. I, I, I need to explain some, some things to you, please. You, you want to explain some things to me, Abby? Just, just wait for me. I'm coming. Wait for me. I'm coming. You must you will have it. Amara. Amara. My love is. What are you trying to do? Amara. You want to have my audience? Eh? You want to have my audience? Amara. 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 Give me. Amara. Give me. Oh, hit stop. me. You have the right to hit me. Okay. I, I know I've wronged you. I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Joe. I know. Please, you need to help me talk to Amara. I'm sorry. From the deepest part of my heart, I, I know I've wronged her. W what I did to Amara is it's untold, but I'm sorry. I, I, I'm a different person now. She may not understand, but the decision I took was for good. Please, it would be a great honor if you, if you can convince Amarad to at least give me audience to speak with her. Please, I have a lot to explain to Amara. Please, Choma, please help me on this one. Please. You need to hear him out. Why should I give him audience? Because he is up and I have heard from him.
you heard him. How? And when? He told me. He called you. How did he get your number? Your parents gave. They did because they are wiser. They want the best for you. I'm so do I. By going contrary to my wish? We are seized by extreme emotions. The possibility of positive thinking becomes impossible. And it's only those around us that can stir us back on the right track. I agree with your parents. It is good to forgive. Not necessarily to go back to the relationship. But to heal our wounded soul. Because forgiveness has a way of healing and clearing our spiritual passages. I still don't get it. When we hate, we hurt ourselves. We forgive to free our mind and soul. And when we are free, we attract other things to ourselves. And that is just what your parents allow you to do. My heart bleeds Baby you hurt my heart You hurt me The heart that loves you The heart that loves you The heart that loves you Oh baby Amara, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I beg you with everything you hold sacred. I beg you with everything you believe in. Please forgive me. What I did, I did for both of us. What you did, you did for me? Can you please tell a better lie? Amara, you are so good to me. You fed me. You clothed me. You turned down some precious gifts from men, from nook and cranny, high and mighty, of different classes, just for me. How would I have given you back all the things you did for me? You even lost your job. Not only that you lost your job, yet you took from your hard-earned savings to still give me money anytime I want them. Amara, he's only devil himself who would collect all these things from a jewel like you and not give back. Give back wickedness for my goodwill. Amara, I'm sorry. I thought about how to pay you back. And it was just like a coincidence. Then I met Onyeka. I noticed that Onyeka's father has so much money. Onyeka herself has a business flourishing and she's rich too. And when I noticed that she loved me, I, I just took the advantage because I wanted the connection. All the while I was with Onyeka, my mind was with you. All I wanted is just to make so much money as much as I can and come back to us. Because I know you love me and love without money and wealth is it's more like a punishment. I, I wanted to make it up to you at all means and I vowed I must make money for us to be happy. I'm sorry. That's why I, I am back now because the money is there for us. Look at, look at cars, house, everything. Just the way you want it. Please. Sorry. You should have told me. Rather than how, how could I have told you? How could I have told you that I want to be with another woman? 
knowing fully well that you love me decently and dearly. I'm sorry. That is wrong oh. to throw myself cheaply at the man who has shown me no qualification that he doesn't want to see. So please, can you do yourself a favor and work? Take my mama's advice. Just go out there, walk and look for a man who can love you just the way you are. So please excuse us. I'm out. I don't have this plan to you, but it's for your own good. You should just go home. Because it's late already. What if I've succeeded in committing suicide? Of what use will your money be to me? <laughs> what? You, you try to take your own life by your hands? Uh, I'm sorry. I didn't know it would lead to that. I'm sorry, please. Please, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm here now. I'm here. Please. All I wanted was just to make money and come back to us. Please. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please. Mara. It should be empty because no one has ever lived here. Okay. Uh, Amara, you see, I I thought about a little way to pay back for everything you did for me, Ogi no no. I thought about a way to a better way to say sorry for all the wrongs I did to you. I couldn't have um, done less, so I decided to do it in my own little way. Right here is a document to this toy. It's yours. Say that again. This house belongs to you. No, no, no. no. Am I right to No, 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 no. Tell me you're joking. You did more than this, so this is nothing. <laughs> Come on, go ahead, look at the papers. It's yours. When it's 
Thank you so much. Thank you for making me a house owner. That's nothing. I, I should be the one thanking you. I should be the one thanking you for freeing me. I, I've lived all my life so sad and unhappy. Knowing fully well that I wronged you. That I wronged you deeply. But anytime I remember it, I feel what? Thank you for forgiving me. Can I ask you for one more favor? Of course, sure. Go on. Amara, you and I have always wished to be together, play and laugh and quarrel and do some nasty things together. I remember one day you said then that you can't wait for me to come announce to your parents how much I love you. Can we just go do, go break that beautiful news to them like right now? <laughs> what beautiful news? I want to make you my wife. I can't live this life happy again without you. I lost you, then I don't want to lose you again. Can, can we just go and meet your parents like now, today, or tomorrow? Like, <laughs> Why do you want to be my parents? Just to tell them that I want to marry you. Now take it to the next week. Oh, okay. Next week. Thank you so much. Come here. Come here. No. No. You don't want me to kiss you? No. It's okay. I'm not in a hurry. Uh -huh. Just to make you my wife, and I'll have it every day, every night, every morning, anytime. You see? Now you're talking. <laughs> okay. In that case, I. I will be leaving for China uh, the day after tomorrow. But I'm not going to be long. I'm just going to be away for six days. So as soon as I come back, I want everything to swing into action so can, I can pay a red price and do some necessary things. Is that okay? Yes, that's fine. Okay. I've missed you so much. I missed our fight times. I missed. We love those times you lock up the and say, Oh, ho, ho, ho. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you here? Because I've been inside. I even dozed off waiting for your friend. Meanwhile, you said she went to work with a friend. I mean, male or female? Well, there is no problem. But to me, it's a problem. You know, to others, they may not consider it a problem. Choma, 
since I reconnected with your friend, I have not really concentrated. Like, my normal routine, I had to do all the things I've been doing freely without thinking about her every now and then. I, I don't even sleep well thinking about Amara. The truth is, I am in love with your friend. Have you told her about it? Exactly where I am here. And she's nowhere to be found. I don't even know who she went out with. Like, am I getting jealous? Really? Anyway, um, Chama, I am in love with your friend, Biko. I. Anyway, I don't want to bother you with my problem. I'll come back next time, okay? Sooner than you expect. Okay. I miss you greatly. I miss you too. So, what are we going to see your friends? No matter I do without you, is so empty here. So, when next time I see you again? Oh, oh, you're making me feel guilty here. Come on. I saw you two days ago now. It's not enough. Like, I don't want you to just see me and leave. I want you permanently. So, when are we going to see your parents? <laughs> I'm missing you too. 
please be patient, okay? Next week we'll go see my parents. Okay. Don't forget I love you. Alright. <laughs> Good night. If you want to go, they like you so what's this love? Amara, why didn't you tell me? Yeah. You shouldn't have given the three of them go. Seriously, that's confusion. So tell me, how do you intend to resolve this? Because I've never seen a thing like this before. My dear, you people asked me to be open-minded to me. I became open-minded and was having fun doing that. <sighs> having fun doing that, I, I also have to protect myself from being hot again. See, I, I didn't know they were all serious. Don't get me wrong. But one thing I know is that I love them all dearly. I know it's difficult to choose, but I don't care. I'm having fun about it. Don't stop me from enjoying myself and having fun, okay? Men don't want it. Trust me. Yes. Amara, this is more serious than you think. Mm -hmm. Amara, you have to make your choice and let others go. Seriously. Uh, think of who to speak to your parents and let others go. That's the sound of the car. Okay, Anybody home? Uh, come Hi. Hello. Hi ladies, good morning. Good morning. Yes. Uh, uh, this way, I guess, well. Yes, uh, what is well. Uh, I'm going to wait for you outside. All right. And don't forget we are late tonight. Okay, then. so much. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. I can see. You're welcome. Good. You guys have a good day in school. Bye-bye. Uh, Bye-bye. <laughs> How are you doing? I'm fine. I'm so surprised to see you here. What are you doing here? I actually came to give my boss um, the report about the hotel I'm managing. 
Okay. So I decided to use the opportunity to come check up on you. Meanwhile, my boss gave me this car so I can use to run around and manage no. it. And a well furnished apartment. Oh, congratulations. <laughs> Thank you so much. Wow, this is I so remember fine. those days when I would come and take you to school and back. And I said, okay, since I'm around, let me come do the same. I'll take you to school and take you back with this car. <laughs> That's so thoughtful of you, but we have our own KK. Mm -mm. I'm going to be around for three days, and in those three days, I'll be the one to take you to school and back. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah. Um, Unless you. I forget, now that I'm around, isn't it about time I came to see your parents? Uh, yeah, actually, I planned on going to see them this afternoon after I get back from school. So from there, I'll talk to them and I'll let you know. Please, I can't wait. Thoughts of you flood my mind every day. I can't do anything without thinking about you. Last night I dreamt about you and here we are. <laughs> Please, once you see them and talk to them, do let me know. Sure, I will. So get into the dance. Side and jealous. Daddy was so risky. Side and jealous. Daddy was so risky. When it comes to play of love, let's lose and win. Some confession of life. She be na hiccups, pick and the love. Man, I di go risk you. I di go dangerous. Somebody's heart has to risk you. Man, if you pick and the love, that it na dangerous. If you pick and the love. Okay, girls, we're here. Just like old times. Yes. Thank you very much. Though. You're welcome. Choma, I'll come pick you up after school, okay? Right. Honey, you have a safe trip to the village. All right, thank All right. you. Take care of yourself. what happened in the house no 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 i didn't bargain for this i didn't know it would turn out this way amara i warned you about this someone that does not know you you would think you're a flirt hey. keeping three men for money or material things amara you just have to make your choice and dismiss the rest dismiss the rest you yes. talk as if it is easy to to dismiss someone that has shown you love oh now Hello? What's it there? I'm fine, thank you. Uh, this number is... This number is local. Are you back? Yes, I arrived from Genova. I'm in Asaba now. Uh, I'm sorry, you will not meet me in Anyoma. I'm on my way to go see my parents. Concerning the introduction. That's beautiful. That's what I want to do. So, Johnny, I'm going to do this. Alright, no problem. Bye-bye. Hey. Sita is back and he said he's coming to the house. What am I even doing here? I think I should go and see my parents and tell them everything. And I'll just call the school and tell them I'm, I'm sick. Amara, calm down. You have to put yourself together before you spoil things. Why, why don't you take a week leave so you'll be able to sort out things once and for all? I'll cover you up in every other thing. I think that's a good idea. Oh, I do. Thank you. Let me start doing yeah? it. Uh, uh, be careful. Be careful. Be careful. Be 
You are welcome. Yes, Thank you, Mama, for cooking my favorite meal. <laughs> You're welcome, my dear. It's really good to be home again. Mm -hmm. You can take some if you want. <laughs> I'll think about that later. Alright, dear. Uh, Papa? Mama? Yes, dear. Yeah. I hinted the both of you why I came here to see you too. Mm -hmm. As it is now, I need your advice. I am confused. I don't know what to do. And I feel bad to, to say to someone I, that has shown me so much love that I am no longer interested. Someone I have led on. I feel like a cheat. I can't even look at their faces. But, uh, Amarachi, I was happy. Just like every other father should be happy. But I thought about three men asking of your hand in marriage at the same time. Well, I am not. And these three men you've given hope. I also thought about they must have been showering you with gifts. I'm talking about reasonable gifts, different kind of gifts. Amaraj, the situation is dies. Mm. My daughter, Mama, is it not your prayer? <laughs> is it not? My daughter, a good commodity will always be sold, no matter how long it is. And a jewel will be seen and sought after. We raised you up very well. And I'm glad you are abided by all our teachings. Why will men not queue up to seek for your hand in marriage? Even the ones that left, they came back. You are a jewel indeed, and I'm proud of you. Thank you. But I must warn you, child. If you know you don't want anything from a man, do not accept his gift. That is what we have to deal with now. That is very true. Very, very true. I personally would prefer to welcome so many suitors than to wait for just one for eternity. Yeah, but the thing there is three of them coming for the same you at the same time. I don't know, have you asked yourself these questions? What do these three men want from you? And uh, what do you want from them? Having asked these questions and possibly having gotten an answer will assist you to take a decision. I mean, a lasting decision. And you haven't taken a decision. Uh, we will also be prepared to welcome whoever that you present to us. Is it not? Yes, it is. <laughs> thank you, Papa. Yes, thank you. Thank you so much. I'll give you an answer very soon. Mm, okay. Uh, in that case, we only have an answer for them. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes, so. I'm sorry. 
Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Oh, did we not present it rightly? Of course we did. Mm. We will not mislead her. We will tell her the truth. But, but like I used to tell you, the truth remains the truth. And it's better at the end. It could be bitter. So but it could be Once she comes up with this, we probably come up with our own <laughs> Hello, my jewel of inestimable value. How was your trip to the village? It was fine. Oh, thank God for Johnny Messis. Yes. Uh -huh. So I already spoke to my parents about him coming. So they said he was coming to come with Are you serious? Wow. <laughs> I mean, this is good news. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. What will happen is I'll go inform my relatives so we can come and do what's necessary. Um, all you need to do is just go to or a company to my Okay then, fine. And I also promise to be the best husband to you. I love you, you know. <laughs> I love you too. Alright, darling, talk to you later. Okay, thank you. Bye. You're welcome. Bye. <laughs> wow! Finally! We can do up the was so risky. We can do that poor, but it was so dangerous. Finally, right? Yes, exactly. And you can come with your people too. Oh, nice. Okay. I didn't know it was going to come so soon, so don't mind me. That's why I'm all excited. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. All right. Okay, I'll see you. I'll see you. Okay, no problem. I'll expect you. I'll be Ah. If you want to shoot, uh, shoot, be let the bad dangerous. If you want to talk, uh, talk, be let the bad dangerous. If you want yan, uh, yan, be let the bad dangerous. If you want to uh, move, uh, be let the bad dangerous. Is this love that I'm seeing? Is this love that I'm seeing? I think we're so dangerous. Sweetheart, how are you? Yeah, I'm fine. I, I am I'm just driving from Lagos to the village. What did you just say? <laughs> oh my god, thank you. Thank you, my love. Thank you, my love. Uh, no, 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 no. Immediately. And the good thing, I, I, I am around already. I'm driving now. <laughs> Thank you, thank you so much. You know I love you. And trust me, I'll make it up to you. For everything that I've done wrong, I'll make them right this time. Thank you so much. You have no idea how excited I am. And you want to hear the music I'm hearing here? Yeah. Uh, 
pick up the love, but not the quite risky. Oh, you could then get a show. Somebody's heart has a risky. Money for the pick and the love. That's in the dangerous game. If you pick and the love. That's in the dangerous game. If you pick and the love. That's in the dangerous game. If you take a pussy, a little time. That's in the dangerous game. If you take a pussy, a little time. I'm fine, and you? I'm fine. Oh. When are you coming to help me for the introduction now? So, who was the lucky person to get the invitation for the introduction? All three of them. Excuse me, what did you just say? I invited all three of them for the introduction because I don't know which one to choose. I'm yet to choose. I'm actually, what, what, what kind of joke is that? See, I want you to come so you can help me for the preparation. It, it's going to be on Friday, so we'll go to the market together. Thank you, sis. I'll just Okay. Alright. So dangerous. That was so risky. So dangerous. When it comes to play of love, let's lose and win. Some comfort. Be done, Sita. Oh, Sita. Oh, my God. It's been a long, long time. Yes, it's been about three years or so we last saw. Wow. You have changed for the better. Look at you. Where have you been? I've been around, just traveling around the world, looking for money. I can money. see. <laughs> Even though I, I just came back um, two days ago from China, I, because um, I want to formalize um, my wedding introduction. Wow. Hey, the good thing I see you here. At least let me invite you. It's over the weekend. Wow. To Congratulations, me. bro. Congrats. Thank you. Honestly, I would love to come. But you see, there's a coincidence here. I'm going for my own introduction the very same weekend. In fact, when I saw you from afar, I was saying, wow, I was going to invite you to mine. But... Not to worry, maybe after the weekend we'll fix some other time to see. That's a big coincidence, but that's okay. Okay, uh, l l your card or something, maybe I'll I can... give you my number. Okay, let me take your number. <laughs> wow! Wow! Turn him What's it that? <laughs> no, 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 Okay, uh, let us now look at the food aspect. Okay. What kind of food are we expecting to cook for our guests? Since we are expecting about 9 to 12 persons, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's do variety. Mm -hmm. Look at variety. I'm thinking of uh, swallow with two different soup. Mm -hmm. yeah. They will have salad, rice, and chicken. Okay. Then. Um, of course, sour native fuba. Cannot forget that. <laughs> oh, dear. yes, yes, go ahead. Then I would, I've already arranged for some women that will help me in the village to do the cooking uh, for the soup. Then, why you and I um, handle the chicken and salad? Okay, okay. Uh, in that case, uh, since you've gone all that far, first thing tomorrow morning, I will go to the drink supplier. To ensure that all the drinks are well chilled. Yes, so I guess that's all. Okay, but yes, that's it. Somebody's hat has a risky. You know I always stand by your decision and judgment. Because you're a mouth full of wisdom. And honestly, you have never disappointed me. But this time around, I'm a little apprehensive about this uh, 
three men coming to ask my daughter's hand in marriage on the same day. It's like it's only you and Amara that know what you're doing now. What are you? Uh, you said earlier a man of wisdom. Mm. Sometimes you allow this wisdom it to be displayed naturally. And you finally will be comfortable with its result. Yes, listen to me. Obin, first of all, I have to appreciate you for the confidence and trust you have in me. Amarachi is our only daughter. And my greatest concern is to see that she gets a very good husband. So I can go any length, I can do anything to please her. Why the rest I live for God? That's what I'm doing. Okay. I'm confused. No, you don't have to be confused. Okay, okay. Let me join them in the kitchen. Uh, please do. Am I step to I uh, want to go to see my I'm going to my They will hear you. Love the sweet This life is good and sweet Money for the big and the rap That thing the dangerous game the big and the rap That thing the dangerous game The big and the rap That thing the dangerous game Yeah, it's a pussy, yeah, it's a total That thing the dangerous game Yeah, it's a bono, yeah, it's a Uncle, I told you today is my day. See, my in-laws are already waiting for me. <laughs> I can see. I can see. Choma, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. You guys are welcome. Uh, okay, um, this is actually Udoka, my very good friend, and this is my uncle, Ibe. Hi, this is Engineer Martins. I'm our uncle. Oh, oh! <coughs> my in-law. Pleasure, pleasure You're to welcome. meet you. You're welcome. I've been waiting for you. Thank you so much. I have to go down. I'm very nervous here. Let's go for that house. I'm like you. One night. 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 One How are you? 
Mas Papa, ini aja gue ngomong ya The choice you make today will live with you forever. I have this to tell you. In human life, true happiness comes from the heart, not from material things. Material things are temporary. It is that which comes from within. That is the thing. I leave it all to you. Thank you, Papa. My love has his call. No, just go. So let me come and see you, sister. Is he inside? No, he's not around. Oh. He went out this morning, very, very early in the morning. <sighs> okay, you know Let me just pick something from you. Hmm? Um, um, excuse me. Um, come, stop, Joe. Don't worry, I'll see you. Yeah. Um. Tell me you are back already. Well, honey, honey, who is this? Who is she? Yeah. Come on, speak up. Who is she? Uh, 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 oh, she. Yeah. Amara. Uh, she, she's my fiance. And she's Amara, my friend. Oh, Amara, how are you? She's your fiance. And I'm your friend. I've never seen you so beautiful. Thank you, Sita. Mm -hmm. You're welcome, my love. You may say I have never asked you this question, but it's time for everything. Okay. Why do you want to marry me? And what do you want from me? I love you. I love you, beautiful woman. That that's why I I had to leave to go make money so I can so I can take care of you, so I can protect you. And now the money is there. And also in China, now the mama. And the last time I know. I'll see you, Shit. Outside. Yes. 
I can't wait to see you. <laughs> so we'll be coming today. Come in. <laughs> see you soon. Bye. Right. Yes, couldn't be better. Very <laughs> fine, thank you. <laughs> okay, fine. Excuse me. I'll be back soon. Whoa! What's going on? What's up, my man? Get on! What? What are you doing here? I thought you said you wouldn't be able to meet my introduction. Oh, of course, I should be asking you. Or did you change your mind to attend mine? <laughs> this is my introduction. No, you gotta be kidding me, man. This is my introduction. Are you joking or what? This is my introduction ceremony. Wait a minute. Do you know Amara Adolfos? Amara is my fiance. You know her. No, Amara is my fiance. What are you talking about? Something is not playing right now. Please come with me, Don. I don't understand what is really talking about. Help me, sister. How can my in-law, in-law, calm down, oh sister, calm down. I know what people want to say. But I will first of all apologize for keeping the boot of you till this time of the night. But I would advise that you, both of you, should go to your seats and wait for us. Uh, in, a in a minute, everything will be sorted out. I need you to calm down, please. Please, just calm down. If you want shoot, shoot. You let you are dangerous. If you want to talk, talk. Wait to have you in my family. I am glad to be here. I thank you for your hospitality. Mm, you people are warm. <laughs> Should I have been here earlier than now? Oh, I can. Why do you want to get married to What do you want from me as a mother and a wife? Okay. Well, I, I don't know why you're asking the question now, but whatever reason. This is a man. Someone selfless. Do you know why? Because they are from a large family. And it works seriously for us when you see a selfless person. I, I see a wife. I see a wife, irrespective of the fact that you're beautiful. That's all I I'll see you soon. Okay. Hey. Wow. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you know I like monkeying uh, around when I'm around. If you want to shoot, uh, shoot. Uh, right. If you want to shoot, shoot. If you want to talk, uh, talk. Uh, if you want ya no ya the lady pa dangerous if you want to go 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 the lady pa dangerous is this love that i'm seeing is this love that i'm seeing i do pa so dangerous pick 
Pican de la pure, à tout quoi se risquer. Pican de la pure, à tout quoi se danger. Ladies and gentlemen, the family of Chief Ojemba, the family of Mr. Johnson, and the family of Onyozo, I sincerely <coughs> welcome you all to my residence. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Thank you. And I am so happy today because you will find my daughter worthy <coughs> to be your wife. It is actually a thing of joy for every father and mother to have their daughter happily married. First to be at one of those happy men. Within one week, a very young man came asking for my daughter's happy marriage. There are so many beautiful girls out there. A lot of them. And not even one man has come to knock on their door. So I am so proud of my daughter. <laughs> However, they, we did what we could do so as not to make mistakes. But during such period, my daughter had no time of asking questions. But finally, she has done that. She has been able to ask questions one after the other. Necessary questions. And the answers of such questions will actually make her decide on who to follow, who is wife to be. So I once again say a welcome to my husband. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. <coughs> um, uh, Mr. Adolphus, thank you once again for welcoming us. You're welcome. You see, my impression was that I was escorting my nephew here to be introduced to his fiancée's family. But, um, so did I know that I'm here to witness the selection of a I must say that I'm can't be cut out of this. Exactly my point. Why didn't your daughter make a choice before inviting everyone here? Huh? Why? In fact, I would like your daughter to do something now. Let her look at the men on their faces. And tell us why she's choosing one and why she would not choose the others. Yes. Well, uh, she's here. And um, I am not the one to speak. She has to uh, make a move and speak so that we will actually know uh, who is here. Mr. Dufus, <coughs> three men, three good men without Bobby to ask your daughter's hand in marriage. It means you have done a good job in bringing her up. <coughs> you know one thing about men. They always choose the women they want to marry without actually checking if the woman chooses them. It will be interesting for a woman to choose. More my people. So, <clears throat> let her make a choice. Because I see that your daughter is a jewel. It's only a jewel that a man plucks and never wants to leave. Your daughter is actually a jewel. So let us see who this jewel will choose as a husband. Uh, well, um, <coughs> it's right. she is here. Yes. And um, we want to see you. Make a move and speak to us so that we we'll all be witnesses to come and show us who's the right man. <laughs> I greet you all, the family of Mr. Johnson, the family of 
Chifu, Uchimba, and Bansdan. Men choose women. Most times, women don't ask why. In the end, the main reason why this man wants to marry these ladies fades out and then strife sets in. Three young men ask for my hand in marriage. And I ask myself, do I have what it takes to make this marriage last? So I decided to ask them one after the other. We were in love. I loved you so much. He left me for another woman because of money. I asked myself, what if tomorrow comes and this money goes? Would you leave me again for another woman to make money? All I needed from you was to love me. Materialistic things don't give happiness. Love does. Okay. We were in love during the insights. But we fell apart and found each other again and started all over again. You said you wanted a mother for your child. And above all, you said you wanted a wife. I asked myself, do I have what it takes to be a good mother? Donatus. You came along and supported me. And you finally decided you want to settle down because of my kids. And because I have a good luck charm. You said I have the beauty you want. You said I have the beauty you've been looking for in a woman. And I ask myself, what if my beauty fades? What if tomorrow comes and I have a scar on my face? Would you still want me? What if we get married tomorrow and I run out of luck? Would you still want me? I don't control them. I can help. So my heart to you. And he stopped me. He said you wanted the money for your child. Above all, a wife. Women need to be very, very careful when a man loves them for their physical looks or material stuff. What happens? If everything fades out, I can uh, please come and meet my parents. <laughs> oh my God.
Mau apa tu lagi? If you want to 